put that on the board. Sorry. <laughs> there is four different answers floating around. And each person, especially people who had 28 and people who had 19, they're pretty convinced that their answer is correct. Raise your hand if you have 28 or 19, and you can explain how it's correct right now. You can show you're not. You had a different answer. Would you tell us what your answer was if your answer is not on the board? Anybody with a different answer than that? Okay, so we're looking at people who got 28 or 19. There's actually two different ways to look at what we're going to do. And how do we decide who has the right answer? That's the hard part. We have to have some way to decide. But let's talk about your reasoning and how you got two different answers and maybe even four different answers. So you had colored tiles that you got to bring together. Can someone who did this four times four first Explain and come on up here. I'll show you how to use the colored tiles on the smartboard and kind of build for us what you did. Someone who did the four times four first. So that means they had an array of four times four. Madison, come on over here. So here's the colored tile. You can literally just keep going and getting as many as you want. Okay, so you made something out of the colored tile. Okay. So Madison and her partner Nick, they made something and they decided to start with four by four first. So she made, let's see, we got one, two, three, and four. Okay, now I'm going to show you something really cool. So you have four right here. Does everyone understand where she got her four from? Yeah. She has four. But we need to do an array. Four times four. Or your doubling. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we can just double it. Paste it here. Paste it for you. Oh my gosh. Right over here. That's cool. We can paste it again. How many times is she going to paste it? How many four. times? Four. four by four. Why are we going to do four by four? Because then you can see. Oh. Cool. So we can see it all. Why is she going to do one more? Because. Four times four. There's four rows of four. Four rows of four. Okay, so then what did you do, Madison? Because the, we didn't get the answer of 16. We had 4 by 4, and then what did you do next? I added 3. Added 3. So take those colored tiles, move them over. 1, 2, 3. Oops. That's okay. That's okay. Move it over there. Keep going. <laughs> All right. I want you to turn and talk with your partner if you agree or disagree with what Madison and her partner did. I disagree. I disagree. Because it's three plus, because it's three plus four, and then it's times four. So I don't think it's right. Because three plus four is seven, and seven times four is twenty-eight. And so if it's four times four, then it, yeah, it would equal um, eight. So that would equal sixteen, and plus the three will equal the nineteen. But it's supposed to be three plus four. If you look back over there. It's two times three plus one. So that one makes sense. So. Hey, class, hey, class. Hey, what? Hey, 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 class, class. Hey, what, what? I heard someone say, it makes sense. But I don't think it's the right answer. Raise your hand if you agree with that statement. It makes sense. They did four times four, and then they added three. But they just don't think it's the right answer. Raise your hand if you think that. Why do you think that, Jada? <laughs> Oh, so you, you already thought you knew the answer before you started yeah. manipulating it. So you didn't really use the model to get the answer. You thought you already had the answer first. Okay, so she just disagrees with the answer because she thought she already had the answer in her brain. But again, what that person said was, this makes a lot of sense. They did the array first, and then they did the addition. Cameron, what are you um, thinking? I think it makes sense, but the plus three was at the beginning. Not at the end. Okay, so you're thinking the plus three comes first. So 
you're wondering why didn't they do that first, right? Hmm, that's an interesting point. What if we did do that first? What would happen? Did someone actually do that one first? The three plus four? Did anyone do it like this where they did the three plus the four first? Sam, what if you do afterwards? Will you come on up and you can use the one So we're wondering if there's two different answers in the class, and the one that you guys think is wrong makes sense. Can you face? Put on the face. Two down. There you go. Okay, move on down. There you go. Just it. Yeah. There you go. So now he's got three lines of seven, three rows of seven. Now he's got four rows of seven. Four, here, put it on the bottom so you can still see what it said. Four rows of seven. Turn and talk with your partner. Does this one make sense? And why? It does make sense, and it, but it's not the way that we did. 